I'm out here dating now. Yeah. 44 years old out here dating. Shit. Who in their 40s dating? <laughs> Just me, huh? Yeah. I'm out this bitch struggling, you know what I mean? My ex-wife was right. It ain't shit out there. It ain't shit out here, y'all. God dang. Every woman wanna go on a five-star restaurant date. Bitch, on your ID, you was just on your ID, you was just at Chili's. Fuck you mean, five star. <laughs> Get your ass out of here. And I notice I be getting a lot of like 23 and 24 year olds want to talk to me. I be like, that's too young though. But, ladies, y'all think that's too young? Yeah. 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 Yeah, I notice y'all keep the same energy when it comes to this dating shit, even. I notice that. When you see an older woman dating a younger man, you hype the shit for her. Okay, Stella, I see you over there getting your groove back. Mm -hmm. As soon as you see a man do it, oh, her dad must not be in her life. He manipulating her. Get the fuck out of here. I'm so full of shit. I think I get the young women dating me, trying to holler at me because I'm on social media a lot. Y'all on social media? Anybody on social media? I think some of y'all need to learn IG etiquette, though. A lot of y'all don't got it. I don't, man. I don't like when people be posting their half-dead grandparents in a hospital bed on fucking IG. I don't want to see that shit. I was going to pray for Mildred. Mildred dead. Look at her. Come on. Got them wig to the side, eyes wide open, mouth wide open. Nobody want to see that shit. I've been looking at ass, 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 now I see Mildred with this bullshit. I don't want to see that. You fucking up the algorithm, that's all I'm saying. You fucking up. <laughs> fucking up the algorithm. I don't like when people be posting the RIP posts in the comments. I don't like the comments. You ever go to a RIP post and go to the comments? Nigga. They be rough in there, don't they? I'm gonna say whatever the fuck they want. I'm gonna with no comments. Oh, I was just with you the other day. Shut the fuck up. Don't nobody care, man. Just put RIP and keep it moving. Shit. Then you got some people, they want to go and make their own post, some personal shit. They put in old text messages, yeah, remember when you ate my ass? What the fuck is you doing? <laughs> Nothing worse than when somebody's saying, well, what happened? Come on, man. <laughs> Clearly, you're not close to the family to know what happened. Mind your business, man. But if you see that and you don't know what happened, what you do? You go through them comments and you see the answer? <laughs> <laughs> what? Come on, well, what happened? Shit, what happened? Finally see that. He got shot in the head. God damn it, what did he do to get shot in the head? Shit. Let me go to my burner account and ask why he got shot in the head. I gotta leave these young girls alone though, man. Dude, they got too much energy for me. They wanna have sex every day. When you're in your 40s, you don't have sex every day. You have it here and there. Like I told this one girl, not tonight. We're not gonna do anything tonight. Call me Lil Spoon, put your titties on my back, we going to sleep tonight, okay? <laughs> Like, I need you to turn me on mentally for me to get, you know, aroused now. I don't give a fuck about your naked body no more. I've seen naked bodies my whole life. I don't fuck about your titties no more, girl. Fuck out of here. I don't care about your ass either. I don't. You need to turn me on mentally. Like, I need to hear some shit like, yeah, I can double your 401k plan. Yeah, shit like that. <laughs> I'm ready to have sex now. Let's go. You hear me? Double my 401k. We out. Told this one girl, I said, yeah, turn me on. What's with some sweet nothings in my ear? She's like, yeah, I'm gonna ride that dick all night. I said, oh, no, you're not. <laughs> you got three to five minutes. I got shit to do in the morning. Fuck all too. I gotta wash clothes. I gotta drop the kids off at school. I gotta play my numbers. What's wrong with your coochie that you can ride a dick all night? Let's get to the problem. This is the problem right here. <laughs> you got some irresponsible coochie. That's the problem. Some responsible coochie gonna wake up at 6 a.m. with me, not you. Shouts out to all the responsible coochies. Oh, clapping? Okay. 